good morning to all the children and parents this assignment is for class 2 for the subject of mathematics being submitted to you on 4th october 2021 children we are going to continue with our lesson 5 division last week we have covered the topics division as equal sharing and grouping division as repeated subtraction division using multiplication facts and division facts this week we will learn short and long division method and repeat relationship between multiplication and division let us begin with the topic relationship between multiplication and division we know that multiplication is the opposite of division therefore we can use the multiplication tables to find the answer so children let us learn this through an example divide 20 by 4 which is written as this way now what multiplied by 4 gives 20 now children say the multiplication table of 4 till we reach 20 4 ones are 4 4 twos are 8 4 threes are 12 4 fours are 16 and 4 fives are 20 so we find that 5 fours are 20 so we'll write here 5 fours are 20 so 20 divided by 4 is equal to 5 so therefore 20 divided by 4 is equal to 5 5 into 4 is equal to 20 you have to say the table of 4 till we reach 20 so 4 fives are is sorry 5 fours are or 4 fives are it's the same 20 i hope children you all are through with the multiplication tables from table of 2 till 10 now you need to know the tables to do the following exercise so let us do few more sums with the help of multiplication table 15 divided by 3 now you have to say the table of 3 till we reach 15 so 3 ones are 3 3 twos are 6 3 threes are 9 3 fours are 12 and 3 Fives are fifteen, so five is the answer here. Three fives are fifteen. Or we, if we write in multiplication, five into three is fifteen. And in the same way, you are going to do rest of the sums. Now let us learn dividing a. two digit number by one digit number and without remainder we we'll learn what is remainder also suppose rita has 20 laddus she wants to divide these laddus equally in five jars so these are the five jars how many laddus will be there in each jar so you can see there are 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4 4
divided equally division means dividing equally also so four laddus in each jar that means we divided 20 laddus into five jars that is 20 divided by 5 let's see in this form see 20 and this is how we write make a line like this and 5 is written out of this you can say this is your house you are sitting inside that is 20, number 20 is just sitting inside number 5 if some guests come to your house what do they do they knock the door so 5 is knocking the door how many times will he knock the door till he gets 20 5 4 are 20 so we will write this on this is the terrace so we will write the answer on the terrace okay so 5 4s are 20 and you have to subtract them 20 minus 20 is 0 or 0 minus 0 0 2 minus 2 is 0 now what is remainder this is your remainder and the number which with we divide is divisor the number which is divided 20 that is 20 is divided by 5 this is divisor and this is dividend this is called dividend and the answer which we got 4 is quotient so you don't have to rem remember this you just remember the remainder the number we get on dividing equally is called quotient. So, the number which we got here on the top is called quotient. So, 20 divided by 5 is 4. Or if we write in multiplication form, 5 into 4 is 20. Okay. Now, let's find the quotient. What is quotient? Quotient is the one number which we write on the top. So, 27 divided by 3. When we do division, we write it like this. 27 in the house, 3 out of the house. Now, say the table of 3 till we get 27. So, 3 nines are is 27 so 27 minus 27 or you can subtract by 1's first and then by 10's you get 0. Here the remainder is 0. The same way we are going to do this also. Say the table of 6 till 36. Write the number here and the number 36 here. 6, 6 are, are 36 and then you have to subtract it. So you will do all these terms. You know the table of 6. You know the table of 3, 5, 10 and 8. And let us. Now children let us take up the last topic for this week. That is dividing with a remainder. It's not necessary that your remainder is always 0. Okay. Now we will learn. There are times when the dividend is not divided exactly by the divisor. The number left at the end is called remainder. So let us learn this through the following example. Suppose we have to divide 85 by 4. 85 by 4. Now let's say the table of 4. 4 we will take 1 1 number. 4 1s are 4, 4 2s are 8. So 8 minus 8 is 0. Now we will bring this number also with 0. You can see the arrow. Now 4 1s are 4. Here we have to write 1. 4 1s are 
फोर बिकॉज इफ यू गो मोर देन फोर टू ज इट इज एट बट एट इज बिगर देन फाइव सो वी हैव टू टेक द नंबर विच इज स्मॉलर देन द नंबर वी हैव फोर वन ज फोर एंड द रिमेंडर इज वन because 5 minus 4 is 1 and there here there is no number that means it's zero you can write zero or you can write one also in this case now the remainder is one it's not zero now children you are going to do few more sums one is done for you two sums i have done the rest you will do it let's see how 68 Divided by three. Now, sixty-eight does not come in three's table, so let's we will take one one number. Three ones are three. Three twos are six. So six three twos are six. Six minus six is zero. Now bring the second number. Eight here. Three twos are. Again six. If we take three threes, are it is nine. So nine is bigger than eight. So we will come to three twos. Are three twos? Are the number should be smaller. Three twos are six. Subtract it. Eight minus six is two. Here also five ones are five. Ninety-six divided by five. Five ones are five. Here the number is not written. You will write five ones are five. Nine minus five is four. Then you bring this number here down six. Now it becomes forty-six. Now say the table. Five nines are nine is not written here. We will write here nine. Five nines are forty-five. So forty-six minus forty-five. We will take first ones. Six minus five is one. Four minus four is zero. And children, I hope you have understood. So you will solve all these up to number twelve, and you will get the answer keys. on thursday so goodbye children